and just show that you know everyone matters, every child matters, everyone's important. It's a sign of you acknowledging that and the love that you have. Up and down the Okanagan Valley, people are wearing orange shirts to remember the use of residential schools and the impact on Indigenous communities. It's funny because I was here yesterday um, giving shirts out to people within the community and I wore my shirt and I went home and my kid said to me, hey dad, we're doing orange shirt day tomorrow. And I said to my son, do you know what? Do you know what that means? Do you know what um, Orange Shirt Day means? And he's like, yeah. And he started talking to me about, you know, oh, like, you know, he started using words. He, my son is six, by the way. He's a really smart kid. And he actually understood a little bit about this. And I'm so proud of him. And I'm so happy to know that it's now, because we've been doing this event every year, it's now got to the stage where it's reached out to other schools. Now we're still talking about this. It happened many years ago. But now it's good that we are made aware of it, of its history and its impact um, on our society and our communities now today. To find out more about Orange Shirt Day, read Phyllis Webstad's book on surviving residential schools. So the shirts came from our grade two students at the Altima School. Um, they actually were involved in designing the shirts um, they did a really good job of it as well. Fantastic job. Events and t-shirts are being passed out across Canada, working for a movement in reconciliation. For Castanet News, I'm Casey Richardson. Thank you.